of inequality. And then the third factor you've already mentioned, which is that we, there, there are active important players, most importantly China and Russia, who are against democracy. They're against it in an interesting and new way. Um, unlike fascists or communists, they have no substitute for it. They have no ideas, right? In their recent joint statement, the best that Russia and China could do is to claim that we are the real Democrats because authoritarians rule most of the world and therefore authoritarianism is actually really democracy and democracy is really not democracy because it only governs the minority of the world, right? Which is a crazy argument, but it also points up the fact that they don't actually have anything to offer mm -hmm. instead all they do is try to eat up our ideas and criticize them from the inside, mock them.